to work with, and that was up to me to put two and two together. And I found out more about myself at that particular time that I had the ability to think, you know, and to uh, strategize situations. But uh, so they, they I, I knew the answer to the questions, and there was a lot of there was other, circuit, other uh, conditions that I knew the uh, answer to the questions to. So they gave me a little bit of leeway as far as being hostile or bigoted or prejudiced around me to my face, you know. I knew they were still there, but they, uh, they, the, the, the people, the white firemen, didn't give me any problem. Except for one time I was taken into the office and uh, uh, the lieutenant used the, word, used the N word as much as he could and he didn't move me, so he, he, uh, he was very discouraged about that. But uh, uh, nothing happened as far as uh, bigotry was concerned and prejudice or uh, anything like that that I didn't expect. I, I guess that's why I was moved so fast because after I was at this station for uh, just about a year, uh, and they had trained us as heartily as they could, uh, and kept us as busy training as they could, they asked me if I would like to go to a different station. And I told them, be fine with me, you know, because uh, we were sort of, uh, there was all, too much drama. There was drama all the time, you know. And I, 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 I so they sent me to uh, 25s out on Howell Mill Road. And uh, the guys there uh, were aware of me and, and my attitude as far as uh, being uh, discouraged by their actions, their prejudice actions. So they sort of backed off and they invited me after, after, since it was one day a week that they cooked, I think, that, that my, my, my week came up to cook for the, for the, for the crew. And they, they, uh, they gave me the money. To, we got the money together to go to get the food. I went and got the food. I brought it back. And uh, I cooked it. And uh, they started a food fight with the food. <laughs> <laughs> and that was that way, yeah, you know, that was the way, I didn't care, you know, that, that was that way, you know, they wanted to show me that, you know, that what, what my efforts were, you know, worth, you know. So uh, I, I, I didn't care, I just, I just went, went from there and went on, you know. And not, not too long after that, uh, I uh, was drafted into the military. So I went into the military and served two years and I came back and things had. Tell me about the war that you did that, that took you away from the fire department. Well, it was a Vietnam War, and I figured that uh, uh, I would was didn't qualify for being drafted because I was already a public servant. I thought that would eliminate me from being drafted, but I was drafted, and uh, I went into the military. I served two years, uh, most of that in Germany and um, as a radio teletype operator. And um, 